Hello everyone. Welcome to Shere Khan's Straight Tiger tutorial video series. With a series of these videos, we want to empower our new as well as our existing customers so that they can make the most of our incredible trading platform which is Straight Tiger. My name is Rishikesh Prabhavarkar and as the head of Shere Khan Classroom, I have designed lots of online free training programs on various aspects of capital markets. And today I'm here to take you all through our Shere Khan Trade Tigers fundamentals. So let's move on. So friends, in order to start trading on Trade Tiger, you need to transfer funds from your bank account to your trading account. For that, you can click on home, go to the fund transfer option, and then you'll be directed back to your website. You can transfer funds from your saving bank account to the equity trading account, and that's it. If you come back to Trade Tiger and check under reports, you will see uh, the money which is transferred is reflecting in your trading account. So after we transferred funds, in order to get started, let's look at as to how can we add a new market watch. For that, you need to go to the market watch tab, click on the blank market watch button. You have the option of adding a local or a global market watch. Now, what do, what do we mean by this? A local market watch would be saved on this particular system. Whereas a global market watch, you can save it on this system and you can even access it from your Shere Khan mobile app or from a different system, different laptop maybe with your same login credentials. So I'm just saving a global market watch. This is how the market watch looks. Let us add few scripts to it. So right click on the market watch, go to add script. You can also put the insert button on your keypad in order to get this add script box. So first we are adding Reliance. Then let us see, we will add Tata Chemicals. And maybe Tata Motors. Now I've added these three scripts to this market watch. For saving this, I can go to right click again. Go to the load or save market watch option. You can just press Control S, which is a very popular Microsoft feature. And you can save the script list with whatever name you want. And that's it. Now, in case you want to open some predefined lists, you can again go to the market watch section. You can have it based on various exchanges. So let, let's look at the NSE, which is National Stock Exchange. And I'm opening a pre predefined market watch for all these stocks which are there in the Nifty Index. And there they are. You can just right click and check various options which are available over there. So what if I want to customize my market watch? That's possible. You have a predefined market watch open for Nifty scripts. Now let's say I don't want the column for news and event. I can just hold my mouse there, drag it down and that's it. You can do that with whichever, whichever columns you're not comfortable with and you can take them out. For more such customizing options for market watch, you can go to the settings option, go to user settings and select the market watch option there. We have other options which you can use for customizing it as per your choice. So let's now look at the most important feature of placing an order. Let us say you want to place an order for Axis Bank. You can right click and click on buy script. You can also use a shortcut which is either the plus button on your keyboard or the F1 button. Once you do that, you get this order book. You decide the number of shares you want to buy. Decide the price at which you want to buy it. And say place order. Once you confirm it, that's it, your order is placed. Now, how do you check these orders? You go to report section, go to order book. And here are the pending orders which you placed for the day. You can even modify them or cancel them if you want. Similarly, under the report section, you have the option for net positions. So your executed trades for the day can be seen under the net position. You can either add a position to that or you can square it off as well. Now moving on, if you want to trade based on Shere Khan's recommendations, you can always do that from our research tab on Trade Tiger. You can go to research and these are the various options available. You can click on today's calls and updates for checking recommendations given by Shere Khan on that particular day. 
you can look at call watch for looking at all our product recommendations you can click on strategy watch you can click on stock ideas for checking all our long term recommendations you can click on top picks basket which is one other investment product you can click on any of these icons to check as to what do you all we offer in fundamental research and you can see that report also accordingly finally you can click on the call performance for checking our performances across the recommendations through various products now in order to enable this research tab on trade tiger you can go to the settings button click on user settings and then select the research tab you need to tick this enable all pop-ups for doing for for getting pop-ups for all our recommendations and their updates therein or you can also do that for a specific product which you are interested in so that is all friends i believe this is enough for you to get started with trade tiger if you have any more doubts please don't worry you can check our other modules in the video tutorial series thank you so much